What up, everybody? It's your girl July from Kickback Couture, and today I'm gonna talk about comp edit mode. So I did this little freestyle where I wrote this verse to this beat, but I'm going to mute the beat so I don't get any copyright strikes because it is an instrumental. So um, the last take was actually pretty on spot, but I'm gonna show you uh, the other takes just so we get an idea of what's going on here. No, I get the job done, I ain't Dolly Parton. My people moving with that iron, trying not to start it. But if they spark it, no regrets, we gon' proceed with caution. Cause haters hate, but love to hear squealing like a dolphin. Ignit, big drip, I'm talking slip wrist. Need some D's on my chicks, don't want no tidbits. I'm from Denver, but my demeanor comes straight from Olympus. Cause I'm gifted, they trying to wrap my presence up like a Christmas. I don't fear it. For you check up on me, I hope they clear it. No, you still talking shh. So I messed up uh, on purpose, which is perfect for comp edit mode because you get to see how you can blend different parts so let's say i wanted to use this take i'm from denver but my demeanor so i know that i kind of slurred here so what i can do is grab the razor tool with r and cut here and let's try to blend in some audio from take two and see how it sounds tidbits i'm from denver but my demeanor comes straight from olympus because i'm gifted and it's still kind of slurred but they may all be this way. Let's listen They're to trying this. to wrap my. I'm from Denver, but. I'm, I'm from Denver, but my. De that sounds okay. Let's go ahead and figure out the Christmas part. I'm from Denver, but my demeanor comes straight from Olympus because I'm gifted. They're trying to wrap my presence up like it's gifted. I don't. So I messed up there as well. So let's listen to the next one. I'm from Denver, but my demeanor comes straight from Olympus because I'm gifted. They're trying to wrap my presence up like it's Christmas. I messed up there so the idea is that the one that is highlighted is the one that's going to play back in this top audio clip so basically you get to piece together different parts of your takes and create the best one i'm from De which is similar similar to playlisting in pro tools i'm from denver but my demeanor comes straight from olympus because i'm gifted they trying to wrap my presence up like it's christmas sound fit so that was perfect so what we do notice is there is popping in the audio and in order to get that out we can easily just crossfade um we get this knob here at the top of these slices which we get by using the razor tool and it allows us to crossfade so let's listen to this first one i'm from denver but i don't want no tidbits i'm from which is perfect because there is pretty much silence here and we do also have this silence clip up here if we want to make an extra point so that we can get rid of we can get rid of breaths this way if we make uh, slices where the breaths are and it'll be silent. But uh, sometimes that's not the best idea because it might not sound natural. It's like using a deep breather on a very extreme setting sometimes. And that's not always a good idea. I'm from Denver, but my demeanor comes straight from Olympus because I'm gifted. They're trying to wrap my presence up like it's Christmas sound fit. For you check up on me, I hope they clear it. So let's go ahead and draw a whoops a um crossfade with this this one which i cannot see okay here we go so it's this little arrow up at the top just drag it to the right and it will crossfade the audio christmas sound fit for you check up on me it's christmas sound fit for so let's try moving it a bit. For you check up on me, I hope they Christmas sound fit. For you check up on me, I wrap my presence up like it's Christmas sound fit. So getting a little delay. Let's try to find a better spot. I'm gonna turn snap off by hitting S and move it this way. Christmas up like it's Christmas sound fit. Uh, Christmas is back that way. Here we can go at this breath. Actually. It's up like it's Christmas sound fit. For you check up on me, I hope they clear it. Cool. Christmas sound fit. For you check up on me, I hope they clear it. No, you still talking shh. And that's perfect. So basically, uh, just to show you, you can make more slices by just using this tool right here. On um, this is the razor tool, which is right here on wherever you want to make slices. So. I can go crazy and make 50 million slices. Of course, Control Z will undo all of that unnecessary -ness. 
So, um, a few more things we could discuss about this is fades, for example. Um, of course, we still have our fades here on the clip. So, uh, if we come up to this point that we see in this corner, I can just drag it and uh, I'll be able to fade. And of course, turning snap off will give me more granular numbers. Of course, you could change the level with this right here of your audio. Move to the far left, and we can also fade in here as we have silence. And as I said before, I believe I said this, the highlighted portions let you know what is playing up at the top. And if you were to click on one of these, it would put it into single take mode and only play that take. So we're going to turn that off because we're using multiple takes. So uh, the volume knobs are over here. If for some reason each one was a different volume and you hadn't had a compressor on it yet, or you don't want to put a different compressor on it, or a compressor in general, sorry, you can definitely change the volumes over here pertaining to each take. And this over here allows you to move the takes up and down. Trying to think what else I can discuss here other than uh, the bounce. So once you hit this bounce button, it will immediately just bounce this take that you've created into one clip. So what I would do is trim this because I don't need this. And then this freestyle, I did omit words so that uh, I wouldn't offend anyone. Omitted words and uh, left them out completely, as well as changed some of the words up. So I would do this and then go ahead and hit this bounce button. And now I have a clip comprised of what I created based off of these separate comp takes. One more thing I would like to add is when you're doing your slices, make sure you're cutting in this area here and not this area up here, or you will cut the entire clip. Rather than being able to edit in this one clip here, you will have two separate clips that you'll have to edit in. So uh, make sure you don't cut up here in this area, cut down here in this area. And um, that's pretty pretty straightforward, I believe, to explain. Um, which uh, you can only do before you bounced. So here we see we made another slice within comp edit mode. If I slice up here, then I have a different clip. And that's not what I want in this case. So um, in order to make slices, of course, use the razor. And uh, you can preview using the speaker tool, which is I from a wherever you click which is uh, very useful and to get rid of slices just simply click on them and hit delete so if you like this video give it a like comment subscribe most definitely let me know what you would like to see next it's all culture kickback and cook up